What's up, YouTube? Do you like Sir Day? I don't want to talk about the game Hatred getting an adults only rating. Man, this game must be really violent. If they got an adults only rating, it's not going to be able, now, it's not going to be able to be on console games such as PS4 and Xbox One. It's only going to be on PC, which sucks. But this game, I got, I, I had no idea this, this would be an adult only game. I mean, yeah, the violence scenes are brutal because, I mean, it's just senseless violence, you know? But the game does look pretty neat. I mean, sure, you're just going on a senseless game. Mass killing rampage throughout the game. That's it. There's no story behind it. It's kind of crazy, you know, seeing how it's, this game's bringing all this controversy to it. Honestly, it's just a video game in my eyes, you know. Sure, the, the, the scenes of violence are a bit brutal, seeing that you're just killing innocent people. You know, it's just really graphic, up close violence. To me, it's just whatever. I'm not really f that affected by it. Sure, it's kind of hilarious, to be honest with you. Like, the beginning monologue. I hate everybody. Everyone's gonna fucking die. I'm gonna. I don't give a shit. I hope I die in a fucking violent way. You know that type of thing. So it's really interesting to see how this game is actually playing out. But is it taken to the extreme? Because I haven't seen the game in its entirety. I've seen like the first level of the game. And yes, it is pretty brutal. But the way it's played out, it's kind of you know, it's got that overhead view, third-person shooter, action type thing, and it's interesting. Too bad I really wanted to play this game. I, you know, I don't play a lot of games on PC. Actually, I don't play any games on PC. So it sucks that it won't be able to come to consoles unless they like tone it down somehow. I don't know how they could tone it down. Like I'm wondering what specific moments in the game make it adults only. You know what I mean? I mean I'm I'm, I'm 19, so it's okay for me to actually play this game. I'm just saying, like, what is it that's really making people just go cr making people cringe and just okay the the ESRB are just saying you know what if this is this is for adults only bam you know and, and that sucks because i really want to play this game we'll try it out even because i'm pretty sure this game you know if it was on xbox one right now I'd probably i don't think it'd be that expensive a game probably be like 20 to 20 30 bucks or something because this game doesn't look like it's that there's no story to it at all you're just going around killing people i mean what's the difference between Grand Theft Auto or red dead or any other open world game where you can just go around killing everybody i guess just because the violence isn't as brutal as it is I don't know, you can throw grenades, you can just mow people down, you can just go in people's houses, just killing the cops. I like the blend of black and white with the color. Like, every time, the only things that show up in color are the pol the police sirens, the police lights, and uh, the fire, and the blood. So that's pretty much the only color in this game, which is really cool. I like the way, you know, it has really good graphics. I mean, do you think Hatred's taking the violence too far, or do you think some people are just overreacting? Let me know what you guys think in the comment section, because... I mean, the game looks, you know, I mean, if you're really angry, if, you had a, if you're having a bad day, I think this is the game you should play and definitely go for it, because it definitely looks like a fun game where you can just, you know, just take out your anger on all these innocent programmed AI, you know what I mean? That's how, that's the way I think about it, because I don't see this game's not going to make you turn into a mass murdering psychopath, I mean, come on now, especially if it's only adults and they're playing this game, so... There's that, but let me just in the comments about the game hatred. Do you think the violence is taken too far, or do you certain think certain people are overreacting to this uh, over violent, supposedly over violent game? Let me just guess in the comments section. Like, subscribe, more content to me on the on hatred and other games in general. I'm Demolex. I'll see you in the future.